Evan, please call me. I really think we need to talk about this. So please, 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 please call me. Hunter. Sorry, we're closing. I know. I have to talk to Will. Sounds serious. You in trouble? A little. Yeah. Too many secrets. Secrets? Huh. Yeah. I know about secrets. When you're staring down five angel fiends all jacked up on wow pills and sweat and pure rage, you make a couple of hard choices about whether or not you want to keep secrets. Do I regret holding on to mine? I don't allow myself regret. You question yourself for one second, and you're just another smear on the pavement, questioning all your life choices in hell. So I became a cafe owner. <sighs> you know what? Anyone who's worried about keeping secrets, coffee's not strong enough. To the poor suckers we're trying to protect. Come on out here and talk to your friend. I'll lock up after. I gotta go home and forget about the past. Does your boss usually encourage you to drink at work? Mm, don't think too much around him. Um, Will, I should apologize. I haven't treated you very kindly. You mean your articles? Mm hmm. Cat told us where to find them. Guess there's no point in hiding them now. Well, you didn't make anything up. Changed our names, you were fair. But I was writing about you. Sure. And that doesn't bother you? Should it? Shane, if I had any shame at all, do you think I'd be caught dead LARPing in the first place? But the others must hate me. I doubt it. Noctis is some kind of internet celebrity, so Arthur's excited. Cat already knew. What about Brittany? If I knew what Brittany was thinking, my life would be a lot easier. She's a complicated person. Yeah. So, what made you decide to go all Harriet the Spy on us? I'm a journalist. It's my job. I was doing my job. Yeah, but why us? Like, what? Well, how are we interesting? My editor wanted an article on LARPing. I already had experience role-playing, so she asked me to do it. It went over well and became a regular column. <laughs> I was gonna tell you guys, it just it never seemed like the right time. Do you like playing with us? Yeah. Otherwise I wouldn't feel so badly about pissing everyone off. How could, how could a LARP cause so much drama? What'd you expect? It's just a game. Is it? Come on. Look, I may not buy into it as much as you nerds. Then why? Why do you play? I play because it gives me a chance to hang out with my friends, including you. You don't play to escape? You'd be someone else for a time? Nope. It's a shame. It can be a liberating experience. It's not really my thing. Maybe for others. I just don't like pretending to be someone I'm not. Maybe, but our characters don't come out of nowhere. They're a part of who we are. You can find out a lot about yourself through role playing. How's in? Hmm. 
Wait. Where are you going? Uh, I gotta talk to someone fishing. Who's supposed to lock up? Well? Oh, God damn it! What's so important that you need to pick me up right away? I drank too much. And now I need to go find Evan. Oh shit. Hey chap. Hey kid. Is Brittany home? One sec. Brit? Lo's here to get his pants back. You, you, <laughs> you know, because you do and, and, and yeah. yeah, no. Not now. Not ever. No. Yeah. Thanks for coming out. Sure. So, um, I know I fucked up, and I realize that I have to fix it for the weirdest reason. Which is? I need to keep playing in the LARP. Never thought I'd say those words. <laughs> Why? Because I want to keep playing with you guys. With, with Sh Shane and Kat and Evan and, and you. Not you, Corellia. You, Brittany. Oh, hey guys. So, um, where's Evan? I really screwed up, guys. What happened? I suck as a bard. I've been letting everyone down. That's it? You don't suck, Arthur. No, I do. I really do. I can't get stuff done. I can't save the day. I haven't been able to in a while. It's just kind of taking its toll. Those are nice swords. Solaris and Nocturna. Are they yours? No. They belong to someone much greater. I don't know what to say. I know that I blew it. I'm not asking to get back together, but I can't afford to let go of a good friend. You keep saying that you blew it but I'm the one who let Corellia bleed into my real life. No wonder you got confused. Anyway, no more of that. I won't let it happen again. What do you mean? Corellia's a character. She uses magic and she isn't even human. She's not real and it was stupid to try to be like her. Wait, you're not trying to be like her? I'm not Corellia. She's a cloak and a pair of fake ears. She's nothing special. Noctis isn't greater than you, Arthur. Noctis was a hero. He shaped history with every action. He was a force to be reckoned with. Just some programmer drone, you know? Now he's gone. I'm just trying to live up to him. You know, he's, he's a legend. I mean, you're not your character. That's true. But Corellia is you. Everything that Noctis was came from you. Everything that made him amazing, everything that made him legendary, came from you. 
You created him. You gave him everything he had. Her confidence, her leadership, her cunning, you know? The way she gets things done. The way she kicks ass. All that had to come from somewhere. Sure, you may not be deadly with twin blades. So you can't cast spells. You may not be the greatest thief. You might not actually be an elf. But a character is more than what's on their sheet. A character's spark comes from you. Your character might be fictional. But that doesn't mean they're not real. No character truly dies. Their essence lives in you. And that's what makes you so awesome. I think I'll order pizza with pepperoni, sausages, green peppers, and garlic dipping sauce. Yeah. Wait, weren't we supposed to talk to Evan? Oh, fuck! Oh! <laughs> oh, God. Damn it. <laughs> you okay? Fuck you. <laughs> Howdy. No. No, not now. Not with so much. Shut the fuck up.